It's been a really emotional day here at the talk as we're saying farewell to our good friend, Sarah Gilbert. Sarah, we're going to turn it over to you now so you can tell us what you're feeling. to thank you guys and I'm just like so so much emotion to do that so much gratitude I have for you all <clears throat> um all right let me pull it together <laughs> <laughs> um Cheryl I just want to say I respect you so much uh, you know I you're so kind and warm-hearted and you know for people who don't know at home Cheryl is, you know, the kind of person that gives her shoes away to the audience after the show. <laughs> she, she also takes their snacks in return, so... <laughs> but, no, I mean, you've, you've overcome so much adversity in your life. You've been so brave to share it, and... You know, you've become such a successful human being, not just career, but what you've come from and where you've gotten to is so inspiring, and you inspire me every day, and I thank you for sharing this table with me. Um, Carrie Ann, you are the newest here, but I just felt like we had an instant connection, an instant kind of sisterhood, and we're you know, on the same plane in a way, and you're so warm and kind-hearted and so extremely generous, and I just said to you last night that you are a risk taker, and you felt like you weren't such a risk taker, and you've traveled more in that direction, but from the outside, I see you as so free, and someone who's not afraid to show who they are and say what's on their mind, and to me, that's the biggest risk of all. You really show yourself. I didn't say earlier, just to say that you have a friend in me forever, Sarah. I love you so much. I love you. Same. Forever. I'm going to skip you, Sharon. And come back. I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs> I, you know, I, it's funny because what I wanted to say to you is there are some similarities to what you said to me. It's just, I think you guard your heart and you have such a beautiful spirit and I want people to see that more. And I think they are, you're opening up more and more, but it's so great to see you show your light and show that to the world. And I'm so grateful that you've let me in to whatever degree I've come in and I've told you I'm going to keep banging on your door <laughs> yeah. to get in further. And I also see how you've changed your life more than the average person. You know, you've come from all these dark situations and just single-handedly turned your life around and changed your life. And it's so inspiring. And I think people are just learning that you're really a teacher. And it, you're such a gift to people in that way. So I appreciate it. Sharon, you know, I went to put my thoughts together and it was literally like, I, I thought, what do I say? It was just like a cliche of not having words. And I'll just tell you guys a story from the beginning of the show. I really wanted Sharon to be on this panel and I you know, fought for her to be here and she wanted to do it and I was so grateful and I know this is like completely unprofessional but right after she got the job I called her and I was like, I don't know what I'm doing, how do I do this? <laughs> and she said, just be yourself and I, and you know, you gave me permission to do that over these years, and we've shared so much together, so much joy and pain, and we've been there with each other and for each other through so many moments, and, you know, I have to figure out 
how to not see you every day. <laughs> I'm gonna, you know, be sitting in your yard or something. <laughs> but I love you and I know this is not a goodbye and that we're gonna be in each other's lives and I'll make sure of that. Oh. All right, as we gather ourselves, go get your tissues. There's more to come up next. Some of the most important people in Sarah's life join us for a very special performance. Don't go anywhere.